Hi there, you're watching Tic Tech Tech. My name is Akash and this is our comparison between the Xiaomi Mi 4 and the OnePlus One. Both these phones cost around rupees 20,000 and they both have similar specs which makes them compete against each other for your purchase. So which one should you buy? That's what you're asking and we're going to answer that with this video. So, those are the phones as you can see. Let's start with their design and their build quality. I'll go ahead and show you the OnePlus One next but the Xiaomi Mi 4 first. This is the Xiaomi Mi 4. So the design is very simple. It's got a very nice metal band that goes around it. The metal band has chamfered edges as you can see over here. So this makes the uh, phone very nice and premium because of this steel band. There is a nice plastic glossy finish in the back. So the combination of the plastic glossy back and the steel band results in a phone that is very nice to hold. It's very sturdy, it's very strong and it is easily one of the best phones that Xiaomi has designed to date. It also looks very good when you hold it in the hand. And what I like about this phone is that it's got 5 inches only which means uh, the display is 5 inches and it fits very well in your hand. It's not too big you know which is very important because you want to make a lot of calls in this phone and you want to use your phone for a lot of things. So it's important that the phone is holdable for all kinds of hand sizes and you get that with the Xiaomi Mi 4 along with some solid build quality. Then let us have a small look at the OnePlus One. This phone has a bigger display at 5.5 inches and um, for its design it's got a back that has this rough finish. I'm not sure if you can see it. It's a little rough finish and it's called the sandstone black uh, version that I've got right here. This phone is pretty kick-ass and uh, it also offers very solid build quality but it is a little bigger at 5.5 inches the display so it's a little uh, harder to hold in the hand but if you want a bigger display then you should get this phone. If you want a smaller display the Xiaomi Mi 4 will fit better in your hand. Now what I love about this phone is that there is minimal bezel as you can see there which means you get more screen real estate, you get more uh, space for you to play with Android which is a very beautiful OS which deserves huge screen real estate. So uh, both these phones are hefty, both of them are well built, they feel solid and sturdy in the hand and uh, it's very tough for me to say that one is better than the other, both of them are very good phones. I'm going to give them a tie in the design and build quality around because they're both very good, easy to hold, they are uh, nice and grippy and they use premium build quality so both phones here are pretty uh, well built uh, but which one should you get uh, in this round well depends on what you want I personally like smaller phones which are easier to fit and hold in your hand because I make a lot of calls and I like to you know have a phone that is not too big so for me this phone makes more sense the Xiaomi Mi 4 however if you want a bigger display and you should consider the OnePlus One which is also an excellent phone so that's our build quality the next thing we're going to talk about here is the software on these two phones. Uh, the Xiaomi Mi 4 uses something called as MIUI, MIUI 6 in this case. MIUI is a custom skin that Xiaomi puts on its phones on top of Android. MIUI 6 is what they've got here. It's got modern design language, it's got nice flat icons and it's got nice fonts. So it's a very beautiful looking operating system. It's got lots of great features and it's very customizable and you can do a lot of you know really cool stuff with it. So what it does is it has all the essential uh, qualities of android and on top of that it uses a lot of uh, design language and design uh, tricks that we saw in ios if you notice all this looks like it was inspired by ios so it's got that kind of a thing going so who is this for well if you always envied your friend's iphone and you should love how that looks uh, you should consider this phone because it is a beautiful uh, looking you know operating system and it's got a lot of themes. If you're a person that likes themes a lot, you should definitely consider MIUI because you can add, add and choose from thousands of free themes and they all look very good on your phone. So that is the main difference uh, between this and other Android phones. It's visually very different. It has a different approach to how Android looks visually. So that is MIUI. It's very nice. It's got its own uh, bunch of you know inbuilt default apps which are actually designed very very well and it has access to the play store and everything is normal it's just that mainly it's got a different look and feel when compared to other android phones and i think MIUI 6 is beautiful it's been designed very well and it offers very solid performance on the Mi 4 and then comes uh, CyanogenMod which um, is on uh, default on the uh, OnePlus One 
What's great about Science Engine Mod is that it borrows all its design language straight from stock Android. So it looks a lot like stock Android. Android, if you like how stock Android looks, then you should consider the, the OnePlus One. Uh, everything is clean, light, and very fast. And uh, Science Engine Mod is also very customizable. In fact, it's like a little bit more customizable than MIUI. It offers 10, 20% more options. But the difference is that MIUI offers more options for, you know, themes and all that. They give you more free themes. Sanjin Mod has fewer free themes. You have to pay for most of the themes. But nevertheless, it's a gorgeous looking operating system. It's very light, quick, fast and customizable and has more options for advanced users. So in the end, it comes down to a matter of personal preference. Do you want the MIUI's uh, the Xiaomi Mi 4's MIUI which looks a lot like uh, Apple iPhone and is very quick and fast and has lots of themes and is very colorful or do you want the Cyanogen Mod uh, ROM which is on the OnePlus One which looks a lot like stock Android and has a very different approach to how it does these things. The next thing we're going to talk about right now is display. Now the OnePlus One has the bigger display among these two phones. It's got a big 5.5 inch display and uh, it's a gorgeous looking display it's got a nice pixel density and you know it's got it's great for you know viewing all kinds of stuff i've seen lots of videos i've played lots of games on this and the display is a top notch performer it's also big and i've always felt that android shines and looks very beautiful on huge displays so this uh, phone shows off android in a very beautiful way and you know how it makes it look very nice so this is if you want a big display and then comes the Xiaomi Mi 4 which has a slightly smaller display. It's got a 5 inch display which is half an inch smaller than the one on the OnePlus One. It's an excellent display. It is an IPS LCD display from JDI and it's got a 441 pixel density which is about roughly 30 or 20 or something you know. Uh, PPI more than the OnePlus One which has about 404 if I'm not mistaken. That's the uh, PPI on that. So the difference is not too great. And it's obvious that this one will have more uh, PPI because it's got a smaller screen. And uh, so obviously it'll have more pixels per inch. So when I compared these two displays, I was uh, convinced that I like the one on the Xiaomi Mi 4 better. I felt that it had uh, greater saturation, greater contrast, and that uh, it had deeper blacks, which is very important. So. When I compare these two, I found that the Xiaomi Mi 4's display is slightly better. The difference is about 20-30% and I don't think most users will notice but uh, something you know I spend a lot of time trying to figure out. And I found out that the Xiaomi Mi 4 has better uh, uh, you know, visuals. It offers a better display when compared to the other two. But again the difference is not uh, very big and you know and you should also keep in mind that the OnePlus One is by no way a bad display it's a great display it's a wonderful smartphone it's just that the Xiaomi Mi 4 is slightly marginally ahead of the OnePlus One in the display section the Xiaomi Mi 4 versus the OnePlus One which has the better camera so I went and shot a picture with both these phones I shot the um, same picture simultaneously same uh, subjects and this is the result so you should know that both these phones use the same uh, camera unit. They both have a six lens camera unit from Sony which is 13 megapixels. Uh, they have the same unit in the back. So uh, which one shoots better pictures? So when I went and took a picture of the same thing, I noticed a very big difference. Now both of them have a generous amount of detail, yes. But what uh, Xiaomi's Mi 4 does is that it uh, artificially makes color, the colors on a picture more vivid. Now this, what you see in the OnePlus One here, is the actual green that is used in the uh, wallpaper of my office. But this right here looks better, but it's actually not the real green. It's not such a bright green, you know, it's a more sober green. So what Xiaomi software does is that it uh, boosts the colors in pictures and makes them more vivid and more attractive. While the OnePlus One picture might not look as attractive, it is the real thing. This is what my office actually looks like. But in the Xiaomi Mi 4, things look much better, but it is artificial. So my point here is, it is a very uh, important choice that you make. It's a matter of choice. Do you want more accurate pictures? If you do, you go with the OnePlus One. Or do you want better looking pictures that have boosted colors? If that's the case, you go with the uh, Xiaomi Mi 4. So that is one of the key differences that I noted when I click pictures. Apart from this, both cameras are very good. They offer generous amounts of detail. And uh, that comes, that's quite natural because they both have the same you know, camera unit from Sony, which is a six lens unit. Now we went ahead and we also used their front cameras. And I saw the differences there. And I must say that I prefer the Mi 4's front camera. Now Mi 4 has the 8 megapixel unit over here and the uh, OnePlus One has the 5 megapixel. 
when I took a bunch of pictures, I could easily notice that the Mi 4 clicks uh, better pictures, better selfies, and you know, and does better imaging with its front camera because obviously it has a bigger sensor, and the results also showed that there was more detail in the pictures on the Mi 4, and there was slightly lesser detail in the pictures on the OnePlus One. So, uh, as far as pictures are concerned, uh, Again, I think it's a draw, but when it comes to the front camera, the Mi 4 has the better front camera. And when you talk about video, both these phones shoot 4K, uh, which I think is a little irrelevant because there, there are very few people in India who actually own a 4K TV and, you know, and there are very few devices that we might have in our house which have 4K displays. Uh, but just for the record, both of them shoot very good 4K video. There are slight differences in the standards that they both use to shoot. The, the uh, OnePlus One has a slightly higher standard of 4K that it uses, but then again, uh, it's not really going to matter to you. What does matter to you is the uh, their performance on 1080p full HD video. Uh, when we shot video with these two phones, which you'll see in our uh, camera video camera review, which you should find the screen somewhere here. When we shot uh, video over there, we noticed that uh, the Mi 4 did a slightly better job. Again, it was a very marginal difference. I noticed that the video was a little bit more steady on the Mi 4 when I saw the end, end results. The difference was 10-20%. Again, it's not something that I can, uh, you know, uh, say that no, the Mi 4 is better than the OnePlus One. No, not not true at all. The the results are too close to you know uh, find any fault with. Overall, I find that both these phones have excellent smartphone cameras and they do a very good job with images and video. And it's very tough to say that you know one is better than the other. But you should know the OnePlus One offers more accurate colors. The Mi 4 offers more boosted colors. You know more uh, slightly artificial colors, but they look very good. These colors on the Mi 4 when it takes pictures and video. So that's the main difference there between their cameras and their imaging systems. And as far as apps are concerned, the uh, Apps are also quite different. Xiaomi has a slightly different approach. When you hit left, you get a whole bunch of options here. Important ones like panorama, HDR, audio, refocus, and you can even go to manual mode. When you go this way, you get a lot of filters, which I think you can see here, which is pretty cool. And you can uh, toggle flash on, off, automatic there. You can dive down here for the settings. and. Uh, what I did notice was, which is very important, you guys should see this, the Xiaomi Mi 4 offered faster shutter than the OnePlus One. I'm going to show you right now. Ready? One, two, three, and... You see that? The Xiaomi Mi 4 offers instant shutter. OnePlus One is fast, but it's slightly behind, as you can notice. Again, the difference is again very marginal. The OnePlus One is just lagging behind very slightly, but again, uh, it's not a huge difference. So both these phones are very good as far as imaging is concerned. I totally recommend them in that respect, and you should go for the one that you like. Another important difference between these phones is how good do they sound with music. Now I used uh, the same pair of earphones on both these phones, and I noticed that uh, audio quality was quite similar. But what was different was when I went to their speakers and I started playing music from their speakers. Now this right here is the outlet or the speaker outlet for the Xiaomi Mi 4. And that is it for the OnePlus One, which has a much more bigger speaker unit. When I played music uh, with these phones, uh, the OnePlus One was definitely the louder phone among the two and it offered better uh, audio and uh, results when I used their external speaker, their internal speakers over here. But when it comes to headphones, both of them offer similar performance and you can't really find much of a difference uh, in that respect. So the big question is, which smartphone among these two should you pick? Well then again, it comes to a matter of personal preference. Do you like MIUI or do you like CyanogenMod? mode? Do you like a phone that fits in your hand, which is much more uh, easier to hold for calls and is uh, much more, you know, uh, compact? Or do you want a larger uh, display, a phone with a larger display, but a phone that is not that easy to hold in your hand? And uh, these are the kinds of choices that you should keep in mind. So I think it's very simple, the difference. And when it comes to imaging, as I said, artificial but very good looking pictures, real pictures. So what do you want? So those are the differences that we found between the Xiaomi Mi 4 and the OnePlus One. Now if you want me to answer which one you should get, it's a very tough uh, answer for me to give you because I don't know, I really like both these phones a lot and I'm not able to pick. So I'm going to leave you, like I said, with those few simple choices and help you make a decision. This has uh, the MIUI 6, it's easier to hold 
and uh, it's got a camera that shoots slightly uh, artificial-ish images but that look really good. This one here is a little harder to hold. It might be a little hard when you're making calls and all that. Uh, it's got CyanogenMod, mode which is a wonderful OS. I think it's slightly better than MIUI 6 and it's got uh, very natural pictures that it clicks with its camera but they don't look as good as the artificially boosted pictures on the MIUI 4 sorry MIUI 6 so that should help you understand which is the better phone for you it can't be uh, this is our quick video between the Xiaomi Mi 4 and the OnePlus One we're going to let you make that decision we've just uh, pointed out the differences for you both these are great smartphones in every respect and they do a very good job in being uh, flagship, flagship smartphones from the respective companies that they come from i will let you guys choose what you like best thank you so much for watching this video if you did like uh, the content in this video and you want to see more you'll find the red subscribe button under this video please uh, hit it and you'll you know get our videos as and when uh, they're out and if you did like this video in particular you should the like button which is under this video as well and i will see you guys in the next one thank you so much for watching take care